What's up guys, it's Vinny and you're watching Minex Best. In this video we have the Amazon Fire TV Stick 4K Max. This is the best of the lot that Amazon has to offer for its customers. Um, the best of spec that Amazon can offer. Um, it's being sold on Amazon, Curry's and all the other retail operators. But Amazon sells this exclusively with a sale. Um, this cost me about £36, I think. Um, but yeah, this is on sale, but its actual price is probably 59 Um so that's that's the 4K Max. Um, one of the 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 differences, key differences between uh, the Fire TV Stick 4K and 4K Max is that it, use, it uses Wi-Fi 6 as compared with the 4K, which is Wi-Fi 5. So this is the next gen Wi-Fi 6 capable or adaptable. Uh, think of it as uh, as a difference between 4G and 5G, perhaps, um, or 6G in the future. Yeah, that's that's what it is. Uh, pretty much the same um, as you have the 4K Amazon device, but it's obviously got the Wi-Fi 6 capability, 4K HDR, Wi-Fi 6, as you can see on the box, and the picture of the remote. It's got the Prime, Netflix, Disney Plus, and um, there's another one I can't remember. But that's all that you get. You get you get a dedicated Alexa button with the blue color. And everything else is pretty much the same as the previous generation and the lower versions, uh, the back button, the home button, the menu uh, button, the back, back, fast back, rewind, play, pause, fast forward, um, mute button, volume plus, volume minus, and this is uh, the home, sort of home button, um, again, uh, and obviously the other buttons this is the fire tv stick and you get the adapter and you get the um, converter uh, and extender of the, the hdmi and on the back of the device i probably want to just quickly give you a uh, level up of this um, level up your level up your entertainment experience fire tv stick 4k max gives you the next level performance with our optimized quad core processor so obviously it's got the quad core processor Watch K, it's 1.8 gigahertz, I suppose. Uh, watch 4K Ultra HD content come to life with brilliant HDR and support for Dolby Vision, um, HDR Plus, HDR Plus, HDR 10 Plus, and immersive Dolby Atmos um, audio. Dolby Atmos is already there on the 4K, um, and this is obviously already included. Um, get smoother 4K streaming with the next gen Wi-Fi 6. Watch your favorites all uh, right here. Do more with Amazon on Fire TV. Um, find any action films. Um, show me the front door camera. Play Stranger Things on Netflix. So you could also use the voice control to get to what your content is, where your content is located. Um, press and ask Alexa, Wi-Fi 6, 802.11 AX, 4K Ultra HD, high dynamic range, Dolby Vision Atmos, and quad core processor. Um, that's pretty much it, I suppose. Um, there is uh, what's included, of course, uh, the Amazon Fire TV Stick 4K Max, uh, Alexa voice remote, third gen, true to play batteries are already included, power adapter, USB cable, HDMI extender cable, what's needed. High speed internet with Wi Fi, of course, and you need a HDTV or 4K HDTV with HDMI input. That is what you need. And if you see this, uh, you've got some key products or key channels that are that have sort of been that are already included on the box Pluto, Sky News, and you could use so many other channels uh, Twitch, Disney Plus, Netflix, Prime Video. Uh, YouTube, Apple TV, Hey You, Plex, TV Player, ITV, Now for UK TV Play, and My5. There's IMDB TV as well, which is sort of late, recently launched. But then also you have Amazon Music and Spotify. Um, right, so let's just quickly open it up. Well, we've had enough of the introduction already. Um, so um, you just need to get this one out. And just open this right there. And inside of the box, you have pretty much everything you need. Um, if I would just quickly just pull the tray out, 
you'll have access to everything that Amazon Alexa 4K Max has to offer. Before everything else, you have the Fire TV stick itself. And I probably do not bother to just open it, just keep it on the side. But yeah, if you just quickly have a closer look, um, it's the Fire TV stick and it's got the HDMI input. Pretty much, pretty standard. The um, the uh, micro USB port and it's got the micro USB to USB A to micro USB cable, uh, almost 1.5 for 2 meter long. Um, and this is the remote, uh, as you can see. Prime Video, Netflix, Disney Plus, uh, Amazon Music, and all the buttons that we have previously talked about. And this is the upwards, downwards, backwards, forwards button. This is the power button which can sync with your TVs. Uh, and at the back of this is the slider which would then house the batteries. And finally we have some documentation. Um, Fire TV stick information. Two years of warranty on board. Plus you have things to try, some voice commands and remote pairing, which you could do simple, simple enough. If you can do this, you could use this um, information. You could pause and have a look at this. Uh, and obviously the information around registering your Fire TV stick and completing on-screen setup, tips and troubleshooting. Everything on here can be looked at by pausing and looking at the documentation. Finally, obviously the warranty information. Now, as I said, this is uh, this covers this is covered by two years of warranty um, up front with the two AAA size batteries already included. Maintaining your Fire TV stick to make sure it's not un, uh, close to the vet floor, vet floors, and all of the other safety considerations for, must also be maintained. Uh, you also have full support from Amazon to to be, uh, which is made available for you guys. Uh, product specifications, uh, electrical rating, temperature rating, Alexa wife remote information, temperature rating, and all of that stuff that is already there. Um, I want to just go through all of this information so you can use it and, uh, if when you do not have this information handy. Radio frequency compliance, uh, you could look at all of this information uh, when you need. So yeah, that's pretty much it that you have. And then the converter. Um, let's just open this then. How do we open it? Uh, there was a way to open this. Oh, was it from the side? There we have it. We have the charger um, or the USB plug. This is the one ampere. Um, one ampere is it? Um, output 5.25 volt, one ampere. Yeah, one ampere adapter. This is the downward facing one ampere adapter. I have quite a few of these now. <laughs> I've already gathered a lot, many of these. Um, and then finally we have, um, do we have something in there? No, nothing. And then finally we have the, oh, it's quite quite interesting. Oh, okay, finally, this is the yeah, HDMI adapter. This is for those specific locations that do not work out for your um, Fire TV stick. Let's say, for instance, you have um, a TV which has got the port literally at the back. You could use this to get a sort of an L shape um, of your HDMI to be able to connect this to the um, to the HDMI port, which this would then make you make make it available for the HDMI uh, for the for the Fire TV stick to be connected. So um, that is pretty much all that we have in the box. Um, nothing else really. Um, this is the four, Fire TV stick 4K Max. As you can see, all the contents here. One thing that is missing is the battery pack. I can't see that. Is it in here? It's somewhere perhaps? Battery pack I can't find. Uh, is it in there? I think it's here. Oh, there's one battery. That's a bit odd. Was it not sealed? That's interesting. I can't find the other battery. Did it come off? Pop off somewhere? That's strange. Let's 
There's only one battery in the box. Okay. It's quite odd. Um, did we... Did we lose one battery somewhere? Let me quickly have a look. In this box it doesn't exist. I'm sure it must have fallen somewhere. Oh, it's here. Here it is. So the two AAA Amazon batteries are here. So this is all included in the box. And yeah, that concludes this video. If you have any questions or queries, do feel free to drop them in the comment section. If you have any further queries, um, you can reach out on my social media handles and feel free to subscribe and tap the bell icon next to the channel. Um, that is pretty much it for this video and me signing off. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in my next best. Take care guys and I'll see you later. Bye bye.